island. I'm here with some of the villagers and... Well, they're talking about a curse. A curse? <laughs> Come on, Tal. There's no such thing. I'm sure it's nothing. I'll do some more digging and get back to you. If I can find one in town, you check the beach. Oh, hey there, pal. I heard there was a Lombax on the island, but I didn't believe it. What can I do you for? Afraid not. Looks like some bum stole the bolt straight off the power coupling. I can't connect the darn thing. A nerve for some people. Anyways, if you're looking to get a signal off the island, you'll have to find another bolt. I think I saw someone selling one down by the beach. Who 
choose here. Small galaxy, ain't it? Ah, oh, too small! Oh. So, what brings you to Murder Graw, friend? Well, how fortuitous. I myself am quite the resourceful entrepreneur, if you know what I'm saying. Well, if you ever find yourself in the market for a slightly used VersaBolt, you just come find your old pal. Ah, oh, no names! No names! Ah! Oh. Well, what do you know? I happen to have one right here, procured by perfectly legal means, of course. Ah, with a crowbar! How about we make ourselves a deal? Here you go. I'll see you around, partner. One. Nice going, kid. Local Beacon Union 319 thanks you for your charitable contribution. Here we go. Just put this on here. And... Ah! See if you can give it a good turn there, champ. I do it myself, but I'm on break. Union rules, you understand.
find me, and I'll show you our greatest secret. in the universe. It was created with lenses carved from obsidian glass and powered by a single fulcrum star. Darkwater built it himself so as to keep in contact with his little friends. Can it tell me where they are? Well, sure, if you have a fulcrum star to activate it. Here, I took the liberty of borrowing this from our archives. They're pages from Darkwater's personal journal. Captain's Log, the 3rd of August. The trip to the Bravest Star Cluster was fraught with savings. Not only did I find a great place for cheap crawl cobbler, but I also met a mysterious race called the Zuni. Friendly little creatures they are, can manipulate time and space to their will. Their leader gave me a fulcrum star I can use to talk to them with once they return to Polaris. It's worth a fortune, but I wouldn't part with it for all the bolts in Meridian City. The only worry is me member first made slag. It's only a matter of moons for he tries to pillage me property. But I've taken steps to defend it well into the afterlife using an ancient terachnoid incantation and a coupon for one free curse at the Hula of our Magic Emporium. I'll forever bind me soul to me body so that I may protect the Fulcrum Star. He who disturbs me shall disturb the entire crew. This I swear. Star ought to be locked away with the rest of Dark Water's treasure. Find that star, and you'll find your friend. Ratchet, I think I'm getting a signal. Rusty Pete to Lumbax. I have crucial information about Captain Darkwater. I'm dropping anchor at the whole of our pier. Over and and out. It's about time, mate. I've been radioing you all, all night. So have you found the Obsidian Eye yet? Yeah, but it doesn't work. Darkwater hid the Fulcrum Star. Not surprising. Cheap old Bean Rake never did trust anyone. Of course, we were trying to kill him at the time. Good news is, every pirate worth their salt keeps a map to their buried treasure. A map? Well, where is it? Well, that's the bad news. It's probably still with his body over in Morrow Caverns. Tell you what, mate, why don't you let me help you find it? <laughs> Great! And I have just the pirate to help us. Ta-da! Ah! I call it Slag on a Stick. Rerouted his memory banks to his vocal processor, so he remember anything he's looking at. Now climb aboard, mateys, and put your faith in good old Captain Slag. And so, our hero set forth to Morrow Caverns in search of a map to the mythical Fulcrum Star. With him was Rusty Pete, a noble and true Corsair, adored by women across the galaxy. Ah, uh, this be a work of fiction. Do you even know where we're going? Of course I do. I got GPS. Look! Turn right at Isle of Despair. In five leagues, keep left. I love this thing. Hanukkah gift from me mom it was. <laughs> Arriving at destination on right. Here we 
star, Morro Caverns, famous for its majestic fjords, soothing grottos, and legions of tortured souls awaiting their chance for revenge. What? Uh, what? I didn't say nothing. I still don't understand why we need Slag to find Darkwater. Didn't you help him hide the ship? Well, I was a bit soft at the time. Woke up three days later wearing an evening gown and spooning a kerchief. Ah, watch your tails! So forbidden that only a recitation of the fabled Song of the Dead shall open the way. I'm a little teapot, short and stout. Here is me handle, here is me spout. Thank <laughs> you. 
Thank <laughs> you. 